In today's video, I'll discuss the differences between Minnow and Provitalize. Watch till the end to find out which one comes out on top. Let's start with the differences. The primary difference is pricing. Provitalize costs $49 for a Make sure to check out YouTube's recommended products on the screen or down in the description as they are related to this video and may provide you with extra help with what's been discussed so far. They are usually quite cheap and are unique to this video so it might be worth checking out. Anyway, back to the tutorial. 30-day supply is a one-time purchase, but you can save by subscribing, reducing the cost to $41.65 5 2 bottles cost $98 dollars and three bottles go for $120. On the other hand, Mino is cheaper, costing $42.99 9 a one-time purchase and $34.99 9 a subscription. Two bottles of Mino are $75, and three are $108. Thus, Mino is more budget-friendly. The ingredients also differ significantly. Mino includes black cohosh, ashwagandha KSM66, chased berry, vitamin B6, and D3. Provitalize contains nine ingredients, including algaceri B, Brev, B Brev, Lactus, Turmeric, Moringa Leaf, Curry Leaf Extract, Sunflower Lecithin, and Bioparine. While both manage weight gain, hot flashes, and bloating, Provitalize offers additional benefits like supporting gut health, enhancing absorption, and regulating blood sugar due to its diverse ingredients. In terms of effectiveness, Provitalize works faster, with some users feeling effects within two to six weeks. Menno typically takes 8 to 12 weeks to show results. Therefore, Provitalize provides quicker relief. Both supplements are vegan, paleo, and keto-friendly and made with natural, hormone-free ingredients, making them safe to consume and suitable for various diets. To sum up, while Mino is more affordable and helps save money, Provitalize is my preferred choice due to its faster effectiveness, ease of consumption, and greater health benefits. Check out the links in our description for more information. Thanks for watching.